I had kind of a long night last night. Um, kind of ended up in Google Hangouts, learning about, you know, some new products on E6 here. And uh, so, yeah, I was up late doing that. Uh, so I'm going to start this morning off with some chocolate, compose myself, and we're going to go out. So here we go. <sighs> yeah, there we go. Much better. Much better. Now we're ready. All right, we're up to the farmer's market. And then uh, we're going to go up to the folk festival to see what we can find. So uh, yeah, here we go. Let's get this adventure started. Mm. Dang wind. Vlogger's worst enemy. I guess it's one of those things you just got to learn to deal with. Just not worry about it. Mm. Got the mint uh, limeade this time. Good, with real fresh mint. They it's actually, my favorite. They picked it off the plant. Mm. And anyways, I've been trying to find a geocache here. And I haven't been successful at finding it. I just know from the description it's somewhere around here. Hmm, wonder if I can find it. All right, that QR code just told me I found it when I checked it on my phone. So it's in under here. It's under there. Well, I found it, but from the description on the geocaching thing, they said there's a lot of wires in there. And I am playing with wires, you know what I mean? Dang it, I was trying to talk there, and then somebody walked in there trying to use the ATM, <laughs> which we need to use anyways. But as I was saying, uh, I uh, noticed the QR code on the location of it, so I scanned the QR code, and it seems to be another type of scavenger hunt thing that I was trying to sign up for, but just couldn't do it because we got interrupted. Because some guy wanted to start playing his guitar for my wife, and then I said to my, gave my wife the signal, and we walked away on him. <laughs> That's my woman. <laughs> he just got owned. <laughs> okay, so this app is called Munzi or Munzi or something, but if you look here, yeah. it says there's one right across the street there. So we're gonna go see if we can find it. Yes, I found the Munzi. It was on the pole. Interesting looking one. Yay! Now we're gonna try to find some noms here. And I may get some beer, I don't know. We'll see. I want to try some of these bobs here, some meaty bobs. Yeah, because we haven't had breakfast yet. This is going to be our breakfast. Oh, they got hot stickers. Mm -hmm. This is good. My wife is going nuts over here, literally. Mm. All right, it's beer me time. And I'm going to get my favorite, the uh, smoky Alaskan porter. Ooh, this is good, and I got to get it because it goes good with our little pork that we just had. And uh, we're going to get this. Back in the day, the miners used to be in here, and uh, this is where they would, you know, pull up the mine stuff. Time to take my lovely flower through a walk in the flower garden while enjoying my Alaskan smoke. Come with us, guys. Come with us. Look at this beautiful nature. All those blue ones are pretty. Blue bee. Ooh, there's a bee in that one. Look at the bee eating the nectar. Mm. Oh, I like those red ones. Oh, these are cute. Oh, nice. Real nice. Bees, flowers. Nothing better than a nature walk. Here in a minute, we're gonna check out the world strings at the Broadway um, stage. Look at this. Cool, nice walkway. So there's the Broadway stage, and we got to get over there so we can catch the uh, world strings. Mm. Not spilling my beer. I'm getting low. Might have to get some more. Uh, I'm kind of stuck here. Maybe I have to walk around over there. We'll walk up. We're trying to make our way down to the stage to see the strings, and look who we run into. 
Yeah. Trisha! Hey! Hey! Cool. Call that artwork? Hey! Hey! Can you do better than that? Okay. I believe you. I believe you. Stepmoms. She still owes her studio mom tax. This other instrument, uh, which is shaped exactly like a guitar, but only has four strings instead of uh, instead of what you think of. It's a marvelous instrument. Uh, we'll hear a little bit of that shortly. And all the way down, we have two members of Cop Uh And this is Vietnamese music. Now, I'm not sure what the bowed instrument is called. Uh, and we go all the way down, that instrument sitting on top of the stand there. Uh, we go from the instrument, this with the most strings down there, to the instrument with the least strings. That's a one-string instrument called the dumb bow. But it makes just amazing music out of one string. Well, okay, let's see if we have so much. Hey, let's see if, if, if uh, let's let's move down the line to see see if see if we got anything coming out of the car there. And also, uh, would you please introduce your uh, fellow uh, musician there for us, Celeste? Oh, okay. It's an old instrument, was right. in 2000 before Christ by the Nile River. Okay. They used to play this instrument. And this instrument is made from either gold skin or it could be any skin. And this is the yoke, it's made of wood. And uh, the sound box is, can be wooden or can be a metal. Uh, these are gut strings and uh, it has a very acoustic nature by when you listen to it. And it has two ways of playing it. The first one is called plucking. This is mostly you play it uh, rhythmically, uh, especially people live up in the north Ethiopia, they live in a, like Montana, big mountains, and then the horse riders, they want to play this instrument on the horseback. So first it was used to play like this. And then they want to ride a horse, so they can't do it this way, so they need to play it like this. <laughs> introduce to you the Vietnamese one string musical instrument is called Dan Bo. Uh, you know, on the dumbo, I use two points of my hand to make the harmonic sound. The real sound. Like the guitar sound. And now it's the harmonic sound. And this stem can change the pitches like this. Yo, 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 yo,
just ran through me and it's time to take a piss that was cool wasn't it especially that one with the the thing in her mouth and wow that was really cool um so i want to take a bathroom break here and then we need to get some more beer and then we're going to go up and check out um another event can't remember what it's called but i'll update you guys soon well first of all the hand sanitizer gave me way too much and then here i noticed this gentlemen we aim to please so please aim i'm not kidding you we just found this in the trash and it's brand new huh honey pull it out isn't that cool? She looks tough now. Brand new and in the, in the, in the trash. That's going to make a nice prop for a video. Nice find. <sighs> it's like they say, another man's trash is another man's treasure. All right. I don't know what the camera's doing there. But uh, time for beer number two. That chocolate stout. Yes. <laughs> instrument uh, near the ear of the that person when we feel we falling in love with her so this is the secret of this instrument please keep it only for you because it is a, a national secret interesting that was cool you better not have been looking at that Asian guy honey <laughs> so now we're gonna go see some Vietnamese music and uh, check that out beautiful day today last year it rained on us this year it looks pretty good and I don't like it and, and the wet temperature is not hot the heat wave seems to be kind of over and it's kind of normal heatness so it's not too hot it's beautiful 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 <laughs>
connect the ball with the bamboo flute to make this ourselves. So. No way. <laughs> what is he doing? Puchi? Puchi? Yeah. What does she name it? Yeah, we call it is Squeeze Bamboo Flute. <laughs> <laughs> That was cool, huh, sweetie? It was cool. Yeah, I'll take a picture. There's no snow in the mountains now. It's all gone. So anyways, guys, we are going to head down to the house for a few. Go to the bathroom, do some recharging. I've got to plug in another camera battery to let it charge that I killed already. And uh, I'm also get another beer from the house. So uh, that's where we're headed to now. So. Uh, when we get back, we got to go see my dad. He's playing his band, Vertex Vortex. Well, so far we have bought some stuff. We got some gummy bears. These are called, uh, what, chocolate rocks? Hmm. And my wife wanted those. But I'm going to try a chocolate rock. All right, let's try a uh, blue um, chocolate rock. Tastes like chocolate, shaped like a rock. Back again for beer three, and I think I'm gonna try the row, this one with the pepper on it. There's a pepper on it. I don't know if it's spicy, I've never had pepper beer. It is the Chipotle, Chipotle. It's all right, we're here. It's a little freaky in here, isn't it? I'm Anthony. What are you doing, sweetie? Why are you coming this way? Your face is in my face. That'd be why. But yeah, um, let me know what you guys, what your color preferences are. I can make it a little wider. I'm gonna be bringing some. What's up? Hi. Say hi. Funky designer. What's up? <laughs> so I'm sitting here at this coffee shop computer, and um, I just jumped on YouTube, and yeah, this is why you should log out when you're in a public place. Why? Because some people might delete your videos, change your account information, or make you subscribe to me. Like this, this guy just got a new, yeah, I just got a new subscriber and he doesn't even know he subscribed to me. And just to be nice, you know, because I'm not gonna do anything to his account, I'm now going to uh, sign him out. But, you're probably gonna watch this video now that, you know, I, you just left your account logged in, I subscribed you to me, and you're probably gonna watch this video now. And it's still very hot and very beautiful. Up here in Butte America, Montana. Yeah, America. Just called, just called General. We're gonna meet up here in a few. And I just was going to the bathroom here and what I love about Butte is sometimes these old bathrooms. Look at this, look how high the ceiling is. There's a light up there, but I don't know if it works. Yeah, it works. Window's really high. Got a toilet down there and toilet paper on a shelf and a nice little sink area and a mirror with a plant behind it. Hey guys, hi. And then there's this cool little like fragrance thing candle going on here. Camera case is mine, that's not included in the bathroom. But yeah, we're gonna go pick up General now. 
Look what General found at the thrift store. Yeah. So sitting here doing the uh, scavenger hunt, the only clue was slider look under. And I caught this. Let me get you hold my phone. I caught this hidden right back here. And look what I found. There it is. Found it. <laughs> That's an interesting one. Cool. You found it. Yep. This is a new one. Um, I've never seen one like this before. So we found this one. So we're now at the Bar and Grill getting our dinner on. Yeah. Go. Going to get me a steak. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, we got home, had some good eatings, and it's time to relax. All right here, we're on day two. Just kind of finishing it up. And like a <laughs> vlogger fair, people are handing out free bags with goodies inside. What'd you get inside yours, hon? I got like a, some newspapers or advertisements. And what is that? It's turning around, Tur flip it the other way. There we go. Look at that. That is cool. Look at all these dead animals. Rattlesnake. There's a fox. Yeah, you guys go and you look at the fish in the box. Try to figure them out. You need to make a fish out of it. What should we try today? How about the mocha porter? Will it taste like coffee? Hmm. Kinda, but not bad. Not bad at all. We are inside of a freshly new built teepee with fresh new wood. And it smells so good in here. Wow, isn't that beautiful? wife just loaded up on two big things of kettle corn here and we got some pizza nom noms. Time to get our lunch on. Singing a serenade, waiting for the window to be opened. And while he's waiting, he imagines that she could be sleeping comfortably with the best bed in the world, six sheets, the softest pillow, and yet the window is not opening. So at the end he says, it doesn't matter whenever or whether you are going to open that window because I will stay here forever for you until I die. Bella ci dormi. All right, that pretty much wraps up this folk festival. Look at the beautifulness out there and the breeze. Well, we had fun at the Montana Folk Festival. Oh yeah. So this is Anthony from Anthware, and from this time and every time on, folks, keep on clicking. This is Anthony from Anthware, signing off. Thank <laughs> you.